Plymouth Falls. For the first time, the Clinton administration is stepping in to support another country's currency. And this historic act impacts businesses right here in Southern Oregon and all over the country. Good evening, I'm Jeffrey Riley. Brian Morton has the night off. And I am Beth Fisher. And tonight's top story will look at how business overseas affects local business. With Japan's currency trading at a record low, the Federal Reserve Bank is spending dollars to buy yen. Treasury Secretary Robert Rubin says the help is directly linked to a commitment from Japan's prime minister to repair his nation's troubled economy. The recession in Japan affects U.S. stock markets, corporate profits, jobs, and the price of goods. A group of U.S. economic experts will meet with Japanese officials in Tokyo on what steps to take next. Using dollars to buy yen acts as a temporary crutch for the Japanese currency. A couple of Rogue Valley businesses trade with Asian countries. An executive from one of those companies says global trade usually does more good than harm. Scala Electronics makes antenna systems for broadcasting. It exports about to about 50 countries around the world. Executives say even though the Japanese market is failing, other Asian economies are stronger than ever. They say foreign economies will go up and down, but it's worth the risk. I think the strength in any business is you, you want to be diversified. You have to uh, be able to address uh, more than one market and more than one region. Scala credits global expansion for much of the company's success. Managers say the company does almost no business locally. The company has done so well overseas, it just expanded the plant to cope. Japan isn't the only country with economic...